Hello, lovely viewers. Welcome to Eben Tech Studio. Thank you very much for watching my videos online. In today's video tutorial, I will walk you through the steps of fixing display issues in your presentation software like Easy Worship. Before we move on, I would like you to click on the like button, get notified of every content we put online. And if you have not subscribed, please do so. You can comment and then share the video as well. So without wasting much time, let me show you one of the issues. So you open up Easy Worship and then you try to go live and then the content is not going to your display, um, your external monitor or your congregation monitor or what you might call your projector or your audience monitor or your TV screens. Okay, so this is how you'll be able to fix this issue. But let me highlight the reasons why this might okay. One, it happens when... Um, you haven't connected your TV screen, your projector, or your external monitor to your laptop. If you haven't connected to your HDMI or your VGA, depending on what um, monitor you are using or projector you are using. So let's see how we'll be able to fix this. So make sure you connect your HDMI monitor to your laptop or your VGA monitor to your laptop. Let's do that now. All right, so we are back again. Now, when you come to your, your PC, I would want you to turn off the live. And then when you have turned off the live, after connecting, after connecting to the, um, now after connecting your monitor to the laptop, this is what we are going to do. Press the Windows key on your keyboard plus the P key on your, on your keyboard. And then the projector settings is going to show up here. So you can see, um, projector settings as Windows key plus the P. This um, two key combination will give you um, your your projector settings or it will show it up here. When you are done, select extend. Make sure the extend mode is selected. And then when you have selected the extend mode, this is what you are going to do. Um, come to the live menu. And when you come to the live menu, select options. And then when you have selected options, make sure you change output monitor from output to um, secondary monitor. We aren't going to see that because Easy Worship was already open. So when you are not able to see that, just close Easy Worship. Reopen Easy Worship again. So now we still have that issue. So we are going to live and then options. Now we change the output monitor to secondary monitor. And now we click on the OK. So now our, our content will be able to display on the secondary monitor. So I'm going to show you that um, outside the, the video, I'm going to show you so that you'll be able to see that the content is displayed on our monitor or external monitor or projector. So as you can see, Easy Worship is being opened on my laptop screen, but I'm going to show you what is being displayed on my projector or your, uh, my TV screen. This could be your TV screen or whatever, but um, it could also be your projector. So now let me show you what is being displayed fully on my TV screen. So right here, this is my external monitor or TV screen or projector. And then the content is displayed fully here. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please remember to subscribe, like, and then share the video. Bye.